Mobile makes its way to the start point. Green light goes on. They're away and racing, and Franco Salisbury from the inside shows pace with Modern Edition. Franco Salisbury's going to have a little trouble holding the inside, however. Always Amy goes to second over Modern Edition, and I'm a player trapped a little bit wide, as is Banjo in that run of the first turn. Moto Miss Lily drives through. It's going to end up in the 1-1 spot, followed on the inside by Charlie Dollar. Next then came uh, back in the field by Day's End, who's back midfield, Banjo three wide around it, Armageddon Flame the inside, sneaks up a little bit of ground on the inside from Roll on Gidget, and I'm a player is at the rear. Into the back they run, Franco Salisbury for Mark Callaghan on top, and it led pretty easily over Modern Edition, and always Amy is third on the outside. Now Banjo was trapped three wide, either had to go back or go forward, and the decision is to go forward, so Banjo's going to look for that spot outside the leader. Charlie Dollar three back the inside, the lead time was 31.4. They were followed in the 1-1 one, one by Motu Miss Lily from Armageddon Flame. Next one then on the inside was I'm a Player. They were followed by Day's End, who's got uh, one behind it, and that is Roll on Gidget. As they make their way up to the home bend, 31-0 was the first quarter. And into the straight they come. Franco Salisbury on top, leads out over Banjo, who's done a little bit of work to get there. Modern Edition leaders backs had a lovely run, has as always Amy. It's had cover for the last lap or so of the race. On the inside, Charlie Dollar is three back pegs, followed in turn by Armageddon Flame on its outside, Motu Miss Lily, then Day's End. Next one was I'm a player, second last, and Roll on Gidget is at the rear. Out of the straight they run, and they head to the 800 metre point, Franco Salisbury on top, and the second quarter was 30.5, so a 61.5 half. Franco Salisbury leads them into the back over Banjo Modern Edition. Always Amy, third spot the outside from Charlie Dollar, Motu Miss Lily, Armageddon Flame, Day's End, I'm a player, and Roll on Gidget. Compact field down the back. Favourites had uh, a fair bit go its way here. Franco Salisbury, they haven't got all that f uh, hard in front. Franco Salisbury leads over Banjo, Modern Edition, just being tapped along on the leader's back. Always Amy is set to pounce in the 1-1 one -one from Charlie Dollar, Motu Miss Lily, Armageddon Flame, Day's End. I'm a player and roll on Gidget at the rear. 28-5, they sprinted down the back and Mark Callaghan has Franco Salisbury on top. Still has a nice hold on it. Leads out from Modern Edition, leader's back. Banjo is uh, just feeling the pinch. A couple of pegs went flying there as Franco Salisbury leads Leads into the straight over Modern Edition Banjo. The wide runners Motu Miss Lily and Day's End right down the outside. Franco Salisbury in front though. Day's End is rattling home at the end. Franco Salisbury in front. Day's End flying won't get there. Franco Salisbury over Day's End or Modern Edition. There's not much in it for second and third. Fourth either Armageddon Flame Banjo. Banjo Motu Miss Lily. Uh, I'm a player was wider on the track. Followed by Charlie Dollar. Next one was always Amy. And uh, back at the rear of the field was Roland Gidget. Number one, Franco Salisbury will be the winner. Judge will call for the photo for second and third. Day's End and Modern Edition with two prominent ones there. 28-5, 28-4 were the final two quarters. 28-5, 28-4. So 56-9 final half. 158-8 was the mile rate. And the overall time... We are awaiting after race number four. 31 0, 30.5 with a first two splits. So got the favours early, did the favourite. And it is one and a photo here on race number four, the AVE Technologies Pace. The winner, Franco Salisbury. Is a bay gelding five years by Liz Mara out of Sally Franco, is owned by F. Scroy, R. Romanovich, M. Jackson, C. Morris, trained by Mark Halligan and driven tonight by Mark. Standing by for the second and third numbers to be semaphored. Number seven, Day's End, does get second on the outside. Number seven, second. A bay horse four years by Dawn of a New Day out of Starong Star, is owned by A. Kent, G. Jackson, and N. Elder. Trained by Darren Elder, driven by Brad Elder. And number two, Modern Edition gets third. A bay gelding six years by Modern Art out of My Poplar Girl is owned by A. Muldoon and R. Garrett. Trained and driven by Guy Chapel. 172 and 8. And now confirmed 172 and 8 after race four. 158.7 was that amended mile rate. 158.7 and 229.8 the overall time.
Two and three quarter metres by a nose with those margins. Two and three quarters by a nose. One, seven, two and eight. We're still standing by for tote dividends on race four. There's the all clear on the fourth event, all clear. One, seven, two and eight. We go to race five. It's the Coca-Cola pace. Scratching is number 12, Clem Daniel. Field of 11 to run. No driver changes to advise you of. And the race at 8.39.